Welcome to Top 10 Archive. While peace is ideal, conflict always seems inevitable. While not at war, most nations will continue their research into devastating weapons to remain a contender in the war of nations. While these advances can lead to improvements and forward thinking, along with technological advances, at what cost will we go to remain safe? Number 10. Active Denial System a non-lethal directed energy weapon developed by the U.S. military, the active denial system was designed for area denial, perimeter security, and crowd control. Informally, the weapon is called a ray gun or heat gun because it works by heating the surface of targets, such as the skin of targeted human subjects. The ADS was deployed in 2010 with the U.S. military in the Afghanistan war, but was withdrawn without seeing combat. On August 20, 2010, the Los Angeles Sheriff's Department announced its intent to use the technology on prisoners in the Pitches Detention Center. The ADS is currently only a vehicle-mounted weapon, though police and U.S. Marines are both working on portable versions, which may make this technology more readily available and widespread. Number 9. Autonomous Weapon System this refers to remote-controlled or artificially intelligent mobile robots or devices designed for military applications from transport, search and rescue, and defensive and offensive capabilities. Many autonomous systems are currently in use, but many more are under development. Autonomous robotics could save and preserve soldiers' lives by removing serving soldiers from the battlefield. The goal is to allow machines to operate on their own for extended periods of time, possibly behind enemy lines. Some autonomous systems in development are the U.S. Mechatronic Sentry Gun, a four-wheeled robot outfitted for perimeter movement detection, the autonomous Rotorcraft Sniper System that operates a sniper rifle attached to an unmanned helicopter, and the Mobile Autonomous Robot Software Research Program to develop more advanced military robots. Number 8. Electromagnetic Railgun the electromagnetic railgun is a projectile launcher that uses a pair of parallel conductors or rails, along which a sliding armature is accelerated by electromagnetic effects of a current that flows down one rail into the armature and then back along the other rail. Railguns are being researched as a weapon that would use neither explosives nor propellant, but rather rely on electromagnetic forces to achieve a very high kinetic energy for a projectile. In 2005, an electromagnetic railgun, IMP, or Innovative Naval Prototype, was initiated and achieved its Phase 1 goal for proof of concept. In 2012, Phase 2 is underway and attempting to demonstrate a repetitive rate of fire capability. Number 7. LAWS Laser Weapon System The ANSEC-3 Laser Weapon System, or XN-1 LAWS, is a directed energy weapon developed by the United States Navy. The weapon was installed on the USS Ponce for field testing in 2014, and in December of the same year, the United States Navy reported the weapon system worked perfectly. Law uses an infrared beam from a solid-state laser array which can be tuned to high output to destroy the target or low output to warn or cripple the sensors of a target. Among the advantages of this device versus projectile weapons are the low cost per shot, no repeated manufacture cost, and it doesn't take up storage space. The laser weapon system was designed to intercept enemy projectiles and small crafts, destroying or rendering them inert. Number 6. Gauss Gun Sometimes referred to as a coil gun, the Gauss Gun is a type of projectile accelerator consisting of one or more coils used as electromagnets in a configuration of a linear motor that accelerates a ferromagnetic or a conducting projectile to high velocity. The coil gun generally consists of one or more coils arranged along a barrel, so the path of the accelerating projectile lies along the central axis of the coils. The coils are switched on and off in a precisely timed sequence, causing the projectile to be accelerated quickly along the barrel by magnetic forces. While not a new concept, most Gauss guns are too heavy for field applications and require a more powerful energy source than currently available to make them equal or exceed current firing speeds. If these two problems, along with a few others, are solved, the Gauss gun is capable of exceeding railgun speeds. Number 5. Metal Storm Sentry Gun The Metal Storm Sentry Gun utilizes only one moving part, the bullet. Its design combines the barrel and magazine and has bullets lined behind each other, allowing it to fire at a faster rate. The bullets are fired using an electronic ignition system where, at the push of a button, a series of electrical signals are sent down the barrel to the bullet. 
removing the mechanical firing mechanism has made Metal Storm extremely reliable and the most powerful automatic gun in the world. Metal Storm can fire a devastating hail of bullets in two modes. It can unleash a stream of bullets, effectively making a supersonic spear that can pierce armor, and an unstoppable wall of bullets fired out of multiple barrels. Using 9mm rounds, Metal Storm can fire 16,000 rounds a second through multiple barrels, which is capable of destroying missiles before they reach their targets. Explosive rounds can also be utilized, and it requires nobody to man the gun, effectively becoming a silent assassin. Number 4. Corner Shot Corner Shot is a weapon accessory invented by Lt. Col. Amos Golan of the Israeli Defense Forces in cooperation with American investors. It was designed in the early 2000s for SWAT teams and special forces in hostile situations that usually involved terrorists and hostages. Its purpose is similar to a periscope rifle, as it allows the operator to both see and attack an armed target without exposing the operator to a counterattack. The pistol is mounted in the front of the weapon, which bends horizontally at a 60-degree hinge, and a digital camera and flashlight are attached to the barrel in a bayonet position. On the butt side of the hinge is the trigger, camera screen, and controls for the camera and light. The corner shot is claimed to be accurate and effective with 9mm, 40 caliber Smith & Wesson, and 45 caliber ACP pistols at 328 feet or 100 meters, and 656 feet or 200 meters with a 5.7 by 28 mm pistol. Number 3. Dread Silent Weapon System From Trinamic Technologies, the Dread Silent Weapon System utilizes a new concept of propulsion using electrical energy. The Dread offers an extraordinary rate of fire of up to 120 rounds per minute in controlled burst with no recoil. This combination provides an extremely high hit probability and the ability to simultaneously engage multiple targets. The Dread has a no-blast, flash, or heat signature, allowing it to remain in a sustained fire mode without being detected. The lack of recoil allows the Dread to be mounted on virtually anything and be deployed in any combat situation. Its simple mechanical construction and self-cleaning capabilities totally eliminate the multiple failure modes of other weapons. Number 2. Aurora Excalibur Designed by Aurora Flight Sciences, the Excalibur is expected to fill a gap between current weaponized UAVs, or unmanned aerial vehicle, and manned tactical air support platforms. The Excalibur's smaller scale model was 13 feet or 4 meters in wingspan and successfully tested on June 24, 2009. A full-scale version will be capable of carrying four AGM-114 Hellfire missiles and has a travel speed of 460 miles or 749 kilometers per hour. When the aircraft is on the ground, weapons and payloads are placed over the wings to protect them from damage from dust or debris, but after takeoff, it rolls upside down to a normal flight pattern with the payload and weapons in normal position under the wings. It is powered by a turbine engine placed in an oblique position to generate thrust for forward flight rotating vertically for taking off and landing. With a successful test flight, we will most likely see this device in action for swift, decisive strikes. Number 1. Mayhem The Magneto Hydrodynamic Explosive Munition, or Mayhem, is a weapon being developed by DARPA that would utilize molten metal to penetrate enemy armored vehicles and reinforced structures. The molten metal would be propelled by electromagnetic fields from explosions. The Mayhem program offers the potential for higher efficiency, greater control, and the ability to generate and accurately time multiple jets and fragments from a single cartridge. If Mayhem works, it would be a significant improvement on current explosively formed penetrators. This kind of weapon can be highly effective, but there are some drawbacks according to the U.S. military planners. Drawbacks include them being one-time-use weapons and cannot efficiently form multiple SFPs, or self-foraging penetrators, from a single charge. Not much more is known about this weapon as DARPA is closely guarding their secrets. Hey, your ideas and comments are really important to us. So if you have an idea for a future Top 10 video, let us know in the comments section below. And you can be among the first to know about new videos when they come out by following us on Twitter, Facebook, and our website, top10archive.net. Just look for the links below.